Breaking news, my lovely, wonderful people. EU reports, we are going to present what we know and what we did during the election to the court. Festus Okoye tells um, EU, he said, because EU reports has rather uh, deepened, you know, things for them rather than strengthening, you know, he said, because they are going to present what they know. They will not, uh, it's what they know, they will tell the courts you know, uh, and everything that happened. Yes, agreed. They had to uh, wipe the uh, the whole system for for governorship election. It said, but this was not what they planned. You know that circumstances beyond their control did happen. Well, Nigerians like the case go like the matter is seen. It is best that every single person begins to understand some of these things yes so it is what it is so the eu report is really rather speaking lots of volume eu report is speaking lots of volume and um uh, first also koye jitrin please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like us share subscribe let's get all the details we are going to present what we know and what we did during the election to court first also koye tells Festo Sokoye, the spokesperson of the Independent National Electoral Commission, stated that the commission will present all the information and action taken during the election to the Presidential Election Tribunal Court. He made a statement in response to inquiries about the final report submitted by the European Union observers. Okoye acknowledged that the report contained both positive and negative aspects during the Commission's performance. However, since the matter is currently before the court, he emphasized that they will present all their actions and knowledge related to the election and leave it to the court to make his decision. He said EU was called as an observer and not the one to decide the final decision of what happened at the election. But their report has rather demeaned the people's trust for INEC. This was not what they were supposed to do. They were supposed to observe and tell us recommendations on how to get better. However, we'll present to the court what we know. This is all we will do. He stated, as I mentioned right now to you, we have ongoing court cases and a petition that is already in court. Let the court decide whether the commission performed well or not. We will submit our evidences to the court. We will present what we know and what we did during the election to the presidential election tribunal. And they will make a decision moving forward. From the commission's perspective, there were many positive aspects to the election. So my lovely people, this is what is happening right now. And uh, first also, Koye had to come out and admit that this is what they would do. And they agree that the election results did not really, you know, did not really um, presented to them or made everybody aware, you know, uh, of how things are that, you know, they feel that um, the, their, their position was, uh, was, not well, uh, was not well represented and they feel that the election, you know, was, it, was, it was against them. You know, he said they feel very strongly that the election was against them. INEC did not quite consider them when INEC was making their decision. And, um, you know, they, they, they feel very strongly that, you know, uh, they didn't do well. Okay, they didn't do well. So this is what is happening. So every single one of us uh, must understand it that, you know, uh, we all need a change. Okay, we all need a change and we all need this country to be better. We all need things to be transformed and we all need, you know, we all need, uh, you know, Nigeria to, to become better, you know. So it is it is a matter of serious attention. And uh, first also, Koye, the guy is jittering literally, you know, he's very, very confused because um, things are not looking very nice for them. And um, he's, he's not happy. He's not happy at all. Okay, he's not happy at all saying, ah, what, 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 I mean, what's going on? And, uh, you know, he's not happy at all, you know. So it, it is, you know, it, it is it is something that, you know, and uh, we should pay attention to. Okay, uh, please don't forget, you know, don't forget that, you know, uh, uh, every one of us, 
you know, every one of us have an important part to contribute, okay? Every one of us have an important part to contribute and we must do it very well. So Nigerians, let's all rise up. Let's ensure that, you know, what we need to do to make the country better, everything we need to add to ensure that the difference is made. Let's ensure we do it because there are people, you know what Nigerians can do? Oh, yes. If you do not speak out, they will undermine you. They will, they, in fact, by the time they finish putting you down, you'll be wondering what happened to you, you know? So these things are part of what goes on and every single one of us, you know, must understand that the difference, the difference must be made so that together we can truly, you know, we can move forward. Nigeria needs a whole lot, you know, a whole lot of input and every single person, we are part of it for the change to come. Every one of us, we have an input, we have an impact to play to bring about this change that we've all envisaged. And so, and so nobody should take it away from us and, you know, think that it is all right. It is not okay. It is not okay. It is not okay. There are people who want to ensure that they, they do that which they, they feel, okay, they, they think is the right thing. And I don't understand who tells them, who tells them or who told them that they are the detector, okay, and uh, they are the detector of what, will, what Nigerians will have to be. You know, so these are some of the things that are happening. You know, these are some of the things that are going on and why we all, okay, why we all must rise up together and ensure that difference has been made. Every single one of us must do everything, humanly speaking, possible to bring Nigeria to where it ought to be. You see, we must do that. We must do that. So it is what it is. Okay, it is what it is. Don't forget that if we keep if we keep quiet and we allow you know certain individuals and people to continue to undermine who we are, they will take advantage of it. They will take advantage of it. People who have been given opportunity to reflect truth and justice so that Nigerians can live well, what are they doing with it? What are they doing with it? These are things we must consider and not just leave things to chance, you see. So it is what it is. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can have all our latest news. God bless. Have a fantastic and a lovely day. Remember, you have a voice. Bye-bye.